Well, you might not believe it, but Nuremberg trials is twin, uh, twinning, <laughs> trending on Twitter. And uh, it's, it's pretty crazy. It's not about any ideology. What this is about is holding people accountable that recommended and actually in some cases demanded that people get a certain medical procedure that was not beneficial, was harmful, distinctly harmful, caused myocarditis, caused birth defects, caused all sorts of things. And in a lot of instances, it was mandatory to have a job, depending on what job you had, depending on where you live, to travel, or to even enter an area. I think Hawaii, you still have to quarantine. Like, this is the reality of what was caused around this certain procedure. Now that everybody's allowed to say on a certain platform, Twitter, the truth about things, it trends. Whoa, what a surprise. This procedure that doesn't work, we were all forced to take, and uh, people should be held accountable because people lost their lives. We actually could have been made functionally right sterile as a race. And they're calling this genocide, genocide. Everybody on Twitter is saying genocide. And uh, it, it pretty much is. There's actually a little bit better word. It's called xenocide. That means killing of an entire race or species. And this is, this is the reality of the space we live in, is that people with power and authority think that they can just kill them. People will test on them, experiment on them, do whatever. The, you know, when we believe in Jesus, we understand these things, right? We, we know these things. This is just so people who don't know what's going on can hear. But when you know Jesus, you, you're steadied against these things. Like a lot of Christians didn't take this procedure because they knew, right? The scriptures warned against doing stuff like this. Don't, don't mix flesh, right? Like all these things, right? We could go into it on another episode. But the reality is people need to know what's going on around them because we've been living a lot. And when we start seeking truth, there's one person that's going to be revealed, and that's Jesus Christ. I want you to find him, I'm praying for you. I 